would have thought at 55 years old, I'd be a great grandmother and a college student, but here I am. Hello everyone, my name is Cheryl. I'm here to share a little bit about myself, my goals, and why I feel so many people are apprehensive about public speaking. First, I'd like to tell you a little bit about myself. I am a mom of six, a grandmother of 10, and a great grandmother of one. I've been married to my best friend and social media personality, Grandpa Cotton, for longer than most of you have probably been alive, 26 years. I'm an avid fisherman and love the outdoors. I have a small nonprofit organization that gives away rod and reels to children and also hosts kids fishing tournaments. I absolutely love seeing the kids smile. I have a few goals still left to meet in this lifetime. The first being transitioning from LPN to RN. And I'm working on that. I work in a hospice facility currently. And as my six year old grandson would say, I help people go meet Jesus. I know in my heart that I work in the place that I'm supposed to be. My other goal is going to Alaska and seeing the Northern Lights. This has been a long time goal for me and my family. Hopefully we'll reach that goal by 2025. Who knows? Remember to write down your goals and work hard towards them. Finally, why do I feel so many people are apprehensive about public speaking? Some people are just naturally shy. Maybe they just don't like to talk in front of others. Maybe they have low self-esteem or don't wanna be judged. For me personally, I am shy. I always have been. I'm personally terrible at giving speeches because I am so shy and I get so nervous. I do not like to talk in front of large groups or in front of a camera. <laughs> person to person is fine, just not in, in large groups. In conclusion, now you know a little something about me, my goals, and why I feel people are so apprehensive about public speaking. As a hospice nurse, remember to visit your parents and grandparents while they're alive and can enjoy your company. Because life is short. You never know how long you actually have on this earth and things can change in the blink of an eye. Nobody deserves to die alone. Thank you.